name is Pavan Gadapa. I have come to S. Vyasa Institute. Here uh, there's a health program that's going on. I've been here for the past uh, two weeks. Um, so basically I'm an IT uh, professional working in the project management uh, function and uh, as a result of a lot of high stress I have come here for various reasons, uh, issues related to stress. And uh, during one of the talks I happened to meet Dr. Lakshmikant and um, it was very interesting because he was talking about stress and it really interested me. I went and spoke to him about it and he mentioned something called a genetic brain profiling. So this concept was new to me. Of course I've heard in theory about these things but here is a person who's talking about actually being able to do it for me. I was very excited. I said let's do this. Uh, so you take your fingerprint scan and uh, it basically maps up and gives you a report that talks about how or what talents, skill sets, personal, emotional, mental strengths and weaknesses that you were born with or what is in your genes. So this talks about nature versus nurture. What you were born with is your nature, right? And this is so interesting. The report comes out and he interpreted the report, the scans. And as we kept talking, it got me really, really interested because it was eerily accurate about me, my nature, what my fears are, what my strengths are, things that uh, not someone who doesn't know me really well might know. And here's this person I just met who's reading out from a report which connected to me so well because I felt like someone had just interpreted my life and here I was at a stage in life where I want to or I'm actually considering changing my career because I feel like I was blessed with a lot more things or I could do a lot more things than just be in a desk job, you know. So then things came out which talked about, uh, you know, my strengths, my weaknesses, my potential and I just had like a Eureka moment, you know, like I should have been in a different field. I'm in IT, I should have been in the creative field and it gave me a lot of clarity, it gave me a lot of confidence to say I think I should be doing something else and here is verification or validation for that and it's coming from my brain, my genes, you know, whatever you want to call it, destiny. So I really uh, wanted to thank Dr. Lakshmi Kant a lot because uh, something that was in a nascent stage, this has given me a lot of momentum and, you know, push to go in the right direction and I know what that direction is now, something that was my heart's calling and this has given me that external much needed validation. So if you are stuck in a job which you feel is dead end, you know, because of peer pressure or society, you must have, might have done a course, uh, tried to be either an engineer or a doctor, you know, the peer pressure, parents, all of that. And then you feel like 10 years down the line, what am I doing? You might have a great pay pa paycheck or a sal salary. You might have uh, excellent facilities at your office. Uh, you might be doing incredibly well, but maybe you're not happy inside. So at that point, midlife crisis or, you know, you want to switch careers or if you've just finished college, you don't know what to do. Uh, you know, before, gone are the days when it's just engineer, doctor, lawyer. Now there's a variety of fields you can get into. and. For that you really need to know yourself, right? So people say believe in yourself, believe in it. How do you believe in yourself unless you know what you're capable of, what your natural strengths and talents are? Even your parents are probably not able to understand and tell you this very correctly. So even if you're a parent with a young child and you don't know how to motivate and push that child, you will probably be pushing your dreams onto them. But it makes a real great sense to do this, understand, simple things like if, if the child is an audio learner or visual learner or a sensory learner, it will help them do that much better in that field, understand what their natural aptitudes are, potentials are and it's really helped me in that sense. I now know where I should focus, what my natural strengths, weaknesses are, I can work on my weaknesses, I can optimize my strengths and I can go forward in the direction I like with confidence because I think now I know myself so I can believe in myself so much more. So I think this really helped. Uh, thank you so much to Dr. Lakshmi Kant and I think it really helped me to make a complex life really simple. So move from complexity to simplicity and I think it was, I'm really lucky to have tried this. Thank you.